Hey, Shalom, giving all praises, honors, and glories unto Yahweh, Bashim Yahweh Shai, Bashim Kakodash, double honors to the apostles and elders of Great Millstone, and Shalom to the sincere and hopeful elect. You brothers out there that's prophesying about the times of end and times are headed to, and the true name and the true doctrine for the kingdom of heaven is at hand. It's your brother Kodash Paya, and uh, just coming back with, them, with another article and some precepts to filter it, all right? This is uh, on the CNBC where it states the NFL and Visa will host cashless Super Bowl in Tampa Bay with reverse ATM. So, you, you know, the, the owners of these Super Bowl, the uh, the uh, NFL and the NFL teams, you know, making deals um, for a cashless, for a cashless Super Bowl. They made a deal with Visa, right, in, in Tampa Bay with reverse ATMs. Uh, let's get into it real quick. Before I uh, continue reading that, you also have another article on RT News which states, Football for vaccination? UK could go for Orwell uh, with QR code certificates and health authorities pick carrot over stick. All right, so I'm going to read the first one real swiftly and then uh, get some scriptures. All right, so it starts off by saying, for the first uh, time in 55 years, cash will not be accepted at the Super Bowl. Uh, the National Football League will make its championship game all digital with the backing of its corporate partner, Visa Super Bowl LV in Tampa Bay, will use only contactless payment, there, there that word goes again, contactless payment methods. At the, at the game and the league's uh, fan experience events. Right, so this is what it all boils down to because... Uh, a few months ago, they were stating that, you know, they're going to do away with cash because the virus can spread through that. And um, also, it, it links up with the digital certificate Bill Gates was talking about and uh, traveling and um, track and trace devices, you know, contactless payments and all these new devices that's, that they're building up for these specific reasons. Um is all cashless, and that's going to ultimately lead to a digital-based uh, system, which is going to lead to the market of beats, which is the RFID chip. And you got that on a low scale now on your cards, you know, but ultimately they're going to do away with, like, credit cards and things like that and have a, a, a chip in people per permanently, you know. But these are the uh, shortcoming steps, you know, the procedures of things, and it's just showing you how we're at the end for them to make society cashless and the sports events and uh, even uh, buying things in the stores they're doing that as well um and then remember when you had the uh the coin shortage so i mean all this is is step by step booklet you know like big said but anyway um it says it sounds efficient you know so people you know that that's that's how they're gonna bring it to people it's efficient it's convenient uh, you don't got to deal with money, you know, just make sure you, uh, you're you vaccinated, you got your, 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 your digital certificate, your QR code, you all set, you you got to see that the game is all cashless, so it's, they're, they're making it a, as a social norm, you know, programming the people, you know, slowly but surely, surely in a repetitive type state for people to, to think it's all right, to think, oh, this is the new normal, it's better this way, but not knowing that. This is the image of the beast the scriptures speak about. Because we know what the end game, the overall uh, uh, idea is for all this. You know, the COVID was just a scapegoat. It was a reason, you know what I mean, to, you know, to ignite that, that flame. Um, yeah, so it says... And look, it, and, this, and people, when they, when they take away entertainments, when they take away stores and businesses they're gonna they're gonna uh have people in the state of mind of wanting to take the chip just so they can have their little toys their little entertainment their businesses jobs uh traveling paying bills etc you know it's like it's like taking kid from a candy you tell them what to do they'll do it just so they can get the candy back it's like a, a it's a little psychological man you know, but it's all prophecy, man. And these people, they're not, you know, um, they're not, they're not seeing the 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 problem reaction solution uh, type scheme that's going on. 
Uh, let's keep reading Salak here. It says, We knew it was just a matter of time, she said. We just accelerated that time. All thought COVID-19 helped accelerate ditching, ditching paper currency, the fiat currency, the money. Because remember, we're in, a, uh, I think, $27 trillion in debt and then some. You know, so America's in debt. <clears throat> they owe the nations. They owe these other. So for them to have that great reset, to have a new digital currency, that's going to happen. That's definitely going to happen. Uh, it's Because you got a lot of cashless vending machines now. It's so much. Um, even different devices like wristbands, digital rings. So... You know, like the scriptures say, we're not ignorant of Satan's devices. You know, we're we're well aware of of this 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 man's uh, you know, snares and traps, right? If you have the spiritual eye to discern that, it says uh, Anderson said the decision to go cashless was in the works before the pandemic. I'll take a screenshot of this, showing you how it was already uh. It was already in the, in, in the books. You know what I mean? It says, as part of their contact ren renewal in 2019, Visa was already converting the league's top events into cashless environments. Oh, wow. The new arrangement runs throughout the NFL 2025 season. <laughs> oh, snap. So lock it. I like to take screenshots sometimes, man. Just all right. It says a cash-free Super Bowl was the main goal of our new contact, new contract. Said Mary Ann Rayleigh Visa, senior vice president of its North American marketing division. The plan was to get to a cash, a cash-free Super Bowl within five years, and we're doing it in less than two years. Oh man. Remember when Trump spoke about the Operation Warp Speed? Don't forget about that, man. You know? I mean, that 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 was a whole uh, mouthful I just read. Uh, bring cash, convert... Oh, here we are. Riley said, the ten attendees can still bring cash and convert it into prepaid gift cards of up to $500. <laughs> peace, uh, peace through eight... Uh, Slack here. Through eight reverse ATMs throughout the stadium and the league's Super Bowl mm -hmm. experience, which will be held outdoors. Uh, Visa Fire lives in events 25% percent more when they are using contactless payments. So people tend to pay more, you know, credit cards or whatever. Uh, so there'll be people at the stands uh, switching to all digital payments. Switching to all digital payments. Also will allow the NFL to collect more efficient data on consumer behavior. So they're going to collect the data on, on, on the behaviors. You know, how to pay, the timing they pay, uh, how many people are coming in, uh, how much they're paying. So they're, they're, they're basically getting your tracking, your movements, how much you're paying, and all that goes into the data system. Uh which will inevitably lead to a uh, radio frequency identification chip. The RFID, the mark of the beast, man. It says Visa client can see when, when, uh, where and how much consumers spend. It's heavy I said that because I'm, I'm just now going into certain... Uh, that's heavy, man. I mean, if you don't see that what we're heading to, man, this is the image of the beast coming to life. Like articles like this, man. You got to... Filter it through the scriptures. You have to have that spiritual eye. The UK may offer incentives uh, so people get the COVID-19 jab rewarding compliance with a special QR code they can use as proof of vaccination for entry into sports matches and other events, sources told the UK's Daily Telegraph. So I just stated, reading the other one, how people would have to get vaccinated to go into these stadiums. But now they, they're going to have barcodes, QR codes, which is on their phone, these new apps, to show proof, you know? And you know, with the barcodes, that shows, like, your, your, your information and things of that nature. So they want proof, just like uh, even going to airports, you need uh, digital certificates and 
Everything is going to be digitalized, which is that image of the beast, man. So I'm going to get some scriptures. It's the book of Revelation, chapter 13, and verse number 14. It says, and it's like, uh, all right. And deceiveth them that dwell on the earth by the means of those miracles which he had power to do in the sight of the beast. So Esau, those that's uh, ruling society today, um, the kings of the earth, right? They are, uh, uh, you know, they deceiving people, you know, by the means of those miracles, you know, when they created the atomic bomb, bringing fire down, uh, now they're deceiving people with their devices, with their technology, you know, and then I uh, forget this guy's name, but he was speaking about the fourth industrial revolution. Remember, the industrial revolution is when they went from animals to machines, you know what I'm saying? And that tend to speed up things, um, you know, with these machines, they, they, they're, they're going to try to have that false miracles to deceive people trying to play as God, you know, you can see again, having people walk again, you know, with that chip, that's, that's all these little wicked devices, that's how they're going to persuade people and convince them is for your benefit, but little do people know, this is, this is how they're trying to have people submit it, you know? Just like how they uh, uh, put numbers on cows, tracking them. Like, you're in full, that's full di dictatorship, man. Like, the Lord spoke about not uh, receiving that, man, and not worshiping that and taking part of that, you know? Because now now you're, you're stating that uh, uh, the elites, by putting that in you, you know, and you going along with it, now he's your owner. You know, now you're seeking uh, uh, to him as as your God instead of seeking the Most High. You know, because the Most High is going to perform his miracles, his healings, his powers, man. You know what I mean? Uh, so it says, which he had power to do in the sight of the beast, saying to them that dwell on the earth, that they should make an image to the beast which had the womb, uh, had the womb by a sword and did live. Um, I believe that's going back to Rome. It says, and he had power to give life unto the image of the beast, that the image of the beast should both speak and cause that as many as would not worship the image of the beast should be killed. Because this is all going to be forced. It's going to come down to the wire of where they're going to force people, you know, to uh, uh, inject, you know. Um... Like the speaker for the DOD, the Department of Defense, when he was speaking about it, the, uh, the haves and have not. So there's not going to be no be in between. Matter of fact, this verse goes into it as well. It says that he calls it all, sm all, all, both small and great, rich and poor. No in between, no. The rich and the poor, the free and the bond, to receive a mark in their right hand or in their foreheads. And that no man might buy or sell, right? So you're not gonna have to be able to do anything if you got if if you don't have that that chip in, right? By yourself, say he had the mark or the name of the beast or the number of his name. So let's get real quick. Now you just type in uh 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 devices, right? Now there's many scriptures that um mention devices, but they're not all going into the same thing. So you got to be able to uh you know um understand you know. What 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 they mean by that in in those particular uh, verses? Because you gotta understand the chapter to understand where the verse is coming from. Uh, but just like Job five and twelve, you know, it says he dis disappointed the devices of the crafty. So that's crafty. You know, they they come to they consult. You know, they have counsel the world leaders to come up with these devices, man, new currencies for a one world currency, one world government, one world this. Um, it said the devices of the crafty so that their hands cannot perform their enterprise. So the Lord is going to intervene when they mm -hmm. think that, you know, everyone's going to get the chip. And, uh, you know, just like how it's written in stone in the Georgia Guy Stone, where they're trying to depopulate. Because how they going to, if people don't get the chip, they're going to kill people. You know, they're going to behead them for the name of the Lord. Uh, even people that don't know the Lord, like they might not get, they might, they might not want to get it, but they're going to have, you know. Uh, 
Vice, yeah, that's another one. Behold, I know your thoughts and the devices which ye wrongfully imagine against me. Uh, Psalms chapter 10 verse 2. The wicked in his pride doth persecute the poor. Let them be taken in the devices that they have imagined. Just like uh, during the time of uh, Mordecai and Haman. When he, um, when he created the device for, for the death of Mordecai. But it, it backlashed on him. You know. Uh, Lord bring it to counsel and he's in the not me. Fact. That's a good one, Psalms 33. Uh, because of the press. Oh, that's a uh, Psalms 37 and 7. Rest in the Lord and wait patiently for him. Fret not thyself because of him who, who prospereth in his way. Because of the man who bringeth wicked devices to pass. You know, so that's how people are going to prosper. You know, if uh, paper money is not is uh, done away with, you know, they're gonna have to prosper to what to 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 this digital based system. You know, uh, I guess you could continue reading uh, more into this. Matter of fact, this is a good one right here. This uh, uh, paragraph: The UK's influential policy exchange think tank last month published a paper urging the government to clarify its plan for a national for a national digital ID suggesting because national is nationwide you know uh, suggesting the development of a digital vaccination certificate might be used to increase voluntary uptake wow so yeah man I mean it goes on and on, so, you know, be not deceived, right? Um, in fact, has a roaring line. What's that scripture say? Has a roaring line. Let's pause real quick. Salakia. Now, this is the book of First Peter's chapter 5, verse number 8. It says, be sober, right? So, you know, you need sober, you focus, stay focused, stay aware. Scriptures say, uh, watch and pray. So what are you watching for? We're watching for the times that's coming. We're watching for these prophecies, the the, 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 the spiritual chess pieces that's being moved, you know, and, and, and filtering out with the scriptures so we could, you know, uh, stay aware of, of where, you know, of to be circumspect, like a circumference, to be aware 360 degrees. So you got to be aware of your full surrounding. Of what's going on. Be not, uh, like the scriptures say, be not ignorant of anything small or great. Roughly paraphrasing. So it says, be vigilant because your adversary, the devil, you know, as a, uh, even, uh, you could, that's, I guess that's twofold. The spiritual Satan and his, his physical counterpart Esau, the Edomites, those that's ruling society, the elites, right? Because your adversary, the devil, and also the devil meaning deceiver, as a wrong lion, walketh about seeking whom he may devour. So we got to stay sharp, stay aware, so we won't get devoured by this. So we won't be taken by these, these crafty devices and, and uh, all that. So you got to have faith, you know, to quench the fiery darts of Satan, man. And, you know, stay meditate, uh, meditating in the scriptures and um, praying. And just have your spiritual eyes open. Alright, I hope this video was edifying. Till next time, say shalom.